Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel, and of course, I am your host, Sculpted. Thank you guys so much for coming by and checking out today's video. This is a very, very exciting day. Capcom earlier this morning had a live stream event where they were showing off more information about Monster Hunter Rise, and we ended up getting a third trailer showing a lot of super cool stuff so of course i'll put the link in the description so you guys can watch it yourself but i'll have it playing in the background here while i just give you my thoughts about it and so i mean a lot of cool things i mean just in general more information they give they show off the new map they show off new monsters um specifically one new monster but then they of course show off other monsters that are in the game but this new monster is super cool looking but we'll get more into that of course they show off the village some beautiful music in the background uh, I really love that they started showing off the gathering hub and just the other characters that are a part of the world and it's so cool to see how much more interaction and stuff there is that you can do uh, like they have training area there that you can play multiplayer in the training area in a way and so you can at least have other people while you practice you know just showing off the gathering hub in general and it's just really exciting to see how alive and vibrant that it is and all the new stuff that you could do and how you can interact with other players but outside of that the new monster so they of course had the leak of monsters quite some time ago so we had a rough idea of what we were getting into with these being shown um but the first monster the new monster that they showed was really really cool and it looked like pretty much like a demon bear like an oni uh especially when it comes to the face and the horns and the colors it almost kind of like the smile that it has too it looks like an actual a traditional oni mask of you know just like spirits and demons of that culture which is really cool but outside of that i mean more combat you just get to see the monsters in action in the game which the monsters are looking really really good for it being in the switch but then they go out of nowhere and show us this new feature called wyvern riding which is so cool you actually get to be able to take control of the monster and either use him to attack other monsters or use it as a new mounting system if you just want to ram them into the walls and stuff like that so this is so cool and is going to be really exciting and something very interesting to try that they've now added and outside of that they now show some actual gameplay of the flagship monster Magnamalo in action fighting other creatures which so far is looking really really cool and really really menacing so it's just all the great news I mean there's not anything else new outside of that but um I mean they do show off Tama Mitsune here around the end of the video and just to you know show off just the most beautiful creature in my opinion in the entire game so but no guys I mean really as we just go more to talk about it the demo the, they actually are saying that the demo is going to come out today. They didn't specify the time, or at least if I'm not reading it correctly, it doesn't seem like they specified the time. But today, they're going to be releasing the demo. So be sure you guys go on your Switches, go to the eShop and find that demo because it is only available for download for a limited amount of time. So you really don't want to miss out on that. And in regards to any information to the demo, there is actually a web page that you can see right here. I'll post the link in the description there as well to where you can find all the information about the demo and how it works and what you get out of it. But just to kind of um, simplify it or just paraphrase it a little bit, uh, essentially there's four quests, two of which are tutorials, one's a beginner, one's an intermediate where you can fight the Great Izuchi or you can fight Tama Mitsune. You get to do the all four of these quests upwards to 30 times. You can either do this solo or you can do it with multiplayer, which is cool. Um, it's very similar to kind of how they've done in the past, but la this, this is the first time they've implemented a hunt limit. So be very wise when you do this and enjoy every single minute of each time you go through these quests because you do only have a set number of times you can do them. So do take in as much as you can, use the tutorials to explore the environments and then go test every single weapon see which one you might like most now and then of course enjoy the fun with others but yeah every all the information's on this website here you guys can go ahead and check it out but man this is such a beautiful game such an exciting game i've never i don't think i've actually been this excited for any monster hunter um just the culture and the music just the colors the characters like all of the game just seems to be so much deeper characterized and something I can relate to with most and um, just overall magnificent. 
So I'm very excited about this, guys. I, I know I'm probably spilling words like crazy right now. I don't even really know what I'm saying because I just kept on what's in the trailer. So I'm super excited. <laughs> but outside of that, guys, I hope you enjoyed. Please do check out those links and watch the trailer more if you want to learn more. But until then, I'll go ahead and see you guys in the next video. Boop.